changing from an android to an iphone was one of the hardest transitions that i had to go through but not all good came from it when i'm talking about this i'm talking about the large amount of ads that you actually find on an iphone as compared to an android phone and that is one of the biggest things that i am frustrated about Daddy when chill. using an iphone for example i'm going to talk about blades which is this android app that i actually use for playing my music and watch videos and stuff like that you're going to see that in the illustration that i'm going to provide when i open up the application i'm going to meet myself with an ad when i play a song i might see an ad when i go back and do something else but go back again to change the song i'm seeing another ad which is something that is very very bad and today i've come back with a solution and the way found a way to completely extinguish all ads on an iphone and this one is total ad block total ad block is an is one of the best ad blockers out there that you can actually use when blocking ads on an iphone and this means that total ad block can actually block ads from for almost any website out there and with total ad block you you are able to block banner ads video ads pop-up ads and even tracking cookies that you actually find on various websites out there blocking ads is actually its own advantages when you block ads this means that you are going to have faster internet you're going to use less data because let's say for example you have a two minute video you want to watch on youtube so if you can actually block the 30 second clip that you're going to watch before that this means that a small amount of your data is only going to work on that two minute video but not on that 30 second clip in the ad and with that you're actually saving data and on the long run when you're watching one video after another you are saving data on a daily basis all because of ad block but it this method only has one disadvantage and one disadvantage is that you're going to have limited access to some websites mostly because some websites do not allow ad blockers on their sites and you're not going to be able to use such a website and i think with that information you are actually able to know and trust that the larger side is that you can actually use ad block and there's many advantages and if you want any info on this please comment down below any question i am happy to answer it thanks so much for watching like the video and meet me in the next tutorial next unboxing video